I got some unfortunate news. Uh -oh. Our next guest bailed out. Oh, Are you serious? It wasn't chicken wing, right? Nah, it was a chicken wing, man. She okay. texted me now, like I'm tight, man. Like I was that's why I was looking down, guys. I'm trying to convince her because she said she had to go. I hate I'm I'm so I apologize for everyone for this, man. We're gonna have some interesting topics. I could talk about the topic, but I can't say I did this topic, but I don't talk. <laughs> you know, I, I heard about it in the in the grapevine. So like, maybe I, maybe we can catch him the next time, man. You know, chicken, get him yeah, but, chicken wing is right right now. He's on right now. Oh yeah. no, I, no, I can't. I can't bring. I can't bring the wing in for this. Hell no, I can't bring the wing under this one. He no, but, hot. but no, no. It's, it, you know, the topic's gonna be basically about alternative lifestyles. Like, but like one thing, like Rod and I have a homeboy, right? I mean, everybody got whatever you know tickles they fancy, right? So, Rod, you, Rod, you got the denial face that you know this guy with me. No, I don't even, <laughs> D, D, I'm going to be totally honest with you. I get nervous when it looks like you're going to tell a story. <laughs> I get nervous <laughs> for you. you know, yeah, you know, because because stories. Is, yeah. I don't know if the story's really going to be about a friend or <laughs> it's really going to be about one of us. So, yeah. But go ahead, D. Let's go. <laughs> this is our mutual friend. So, you know, we guys, we talking, right? We riding to this event, right? Four of us in the car, Ronnie, myself. And uh, two other homeboys, no, no names, no names. So one of we all talking stories about you know what, what we like to get on with girls and all those other stuff like that. I told them about you know, oh my, I, God. I used to use the frozen rose, uh, put water on the condom and freeze it. I told them about that story and everything. But that's a, I won't, I won't get into details about that right now. I won't get into details about. It. It's called the ice pick. I just want to tell you, it's, pick. Called, it's right. called the ice pick. It's called the ice pick. But I, I'll explain that later on. If you call me on my cell phone, I'll tell, tell the rest of you. That. So our other homeboys like you know, he's like, yeah, man, know what I, I'm into, man. He's like, like, like getting a fresh haircut. Now, he has a bald head, clean shaven, bald, clean everywhere. And I get in a fresh haircut. Then I get in the tub, and my girl urinates on me. He, he loves golden showers. That's a true that, story. That's a true story. Am I lying? Okay, wait, wait. Let no, me it's not lying. Let me say this. <laughs> I'm not want, into this. I want my disclaimer written on my face. <laughs> right? I, don't, I, don't want to, I don't want to just say I, oh. I, I, he, it, I just want to have a disclaimer put up that, that scrolls. But, but no, the views represent it. Right, yeah, God bless you. He's, he's, right. Right. He's, he's, he's telling the truth. That's a true story. A he true said he story, likes to get man. a fresh. He likes to get a fresh haircut and gets peed on and it burns. Yep. And he get, you know, uh, he do, do me a favor. You two gentlemen give out your emails for so you no. can get the stuff directly. No, <laughs> yeah. no, I don't, want, I don't yeah. want the complaints coming up to, to, to Derek and I. Make this, sure everybody has <laughs> robbed me in the. <laughs> yeah. oh. There's a lot that D left out that story. I and, love a lot. Right. And, 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 and we appreciate and, it. No, 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 I'm going to finish it. I'm going to finish it. I'm oh, going to finish oh, oh, oh. it. It's the alley oop? Oh, yes, I thought we got away. No. Nah, I'm, I'm, I'm going to give you an assist. This is an assist. Oh, it's an assist. All right. Yeah, it's an assist. Right. So this individual is in the car with us. It was, like he said, it was four of us. And he decided he wanted to tell his story. While he was telling the story, the car went completely silent. <laughs> Dude, I'm not saying when they say you can hear. Oh man! So now I think D, you were driving, correct? I was. I was driving. I was. Driving. And me and D were in the front, and they were in the back of the car. And he's telling his story, and um, all of a sudden, um, the the fourth person in the car said, <laughs> "Dude, do you realize who you just told that story to <laughs> in front of? Talking about me and D." So then all of a sudden, me and D looked over each other. And we said, get him. <laughs> Dude, we rode him all day. Oh, all God. these golden shower jokes we talked oh, about God. or whatever. And we, be honest with you, like, we thought only white people did that. You are. You know? See, that's the thing, man. Like, yeah. Like, yo, I didn't, that, this is the same person that did the stud. That stud is uh, a... <laughs> yeah, yeah. This is the same, same person that had the stud when the girl tried to get moral sex. They had stud in the front of the <laughs> so, yeah, Wait a minute. What's the stud, man? Stud, stud, remember, stud, stud is the stuff you, back in the day, it was before Viagra, you spray on the tip of your penis, and then you're supposed to let your thing, it gets around, and you're supposed to stay hard for a long time. So okay. He, he, what it he does is it, desen it desensitizes you, so it yeah. numbs you a little bit. Okay, yeah. Derek, you give out your email. I never get it. I never do. <laughs> now too, Derek. Derek part of it now, too. Derek had to ask the follow-up question. That's what you get. That, 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 oh my God, my, my friend Lisa, Lisa, we wasn't driving with R. Kelly. We no, no, R. R. Kelly wasn't this, in the car. And, th and this is before, I think this is before R. Kelly. This was before R. Kelly. This is before this R. Kelly. Yeah, but you know, like with Biggie, there's some people into like different kind of lifestyles and stuff like that. I'm not knocking it to you, you know, I'm knocking it, you know what I'm saying? Like, 
I heard about this. I ain't never say I participated <laughs> in this stuff. I heard about like you know, like I wanted the young lady to get on because she I know her for a long time. She talked to this swinging S and M and all kind of stuff. Like now we start to see a lot of people talking about these poly. I'm I hope I'm pronouncing this right. My 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 education, my black college education, gonna kick in right now. Polyamorous relationships. <laughs> so and she's into that. So I just like if people want to chime in in the chat, it'd be kind of interesting to see. Like like basically you in love with two people, and you're like in a relationship with two people. And some people say there's uh, some benefits to this because now you have uh, it's, it's three incomes and you know all kind of stuff like that. You're raising kids together. It's going back to that. I guess like you know Africa, they had stuff like this. People multiple wives and families and long Yo, everybody. So it's got to get complicated at some point. I don't know why. It was hard enough. You just having one, bro. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> like the thing is, I'm in a house full of kids with a wife. You know, and that's that's a big job within itself. Just imagine living with two wives and Three everybody. Four. That yeah, it's it's it's, it's got to be complicated. Yeah, well, you know what? I, I'll be honest with you. It's kind of hard because again, some of the stuff I guess is subjective. What people like, I I have to admit, um, I do believe that there's a lot of people that um will front and posture for for you know public consumption and have some real wild weird stuff going on. Um, I don't know any scenarios. Where you want to bring urine into the frame? I, I just, it, it just always seems like something you want to get away right. from you. Like the urine just seems to be. It Why always, are you playing with urine? You? Urine just seems like it should be disposed of. That's right. why I always right. Right. Yeah, it's it's way, right. Right. Yeah, that was that was you know it should it's not for a reason. It should be going. That's yeah. what I always thought. But um, yeah, there there are different strokes for different folks. I guess yeah. literally yeah. and figuratively. Um, but I, I'll say this though. This is what I think is dangerous. Um. Right now, because of the way the internet is, and because younger people have access to anything, when I was a kid, the biggest thing my, my friends and I get together to do, we discovered Playboy books, and that was like a big deal. Okay, today, I mean, that would be, I mean, antiquated. It would be because kids are exposed to so much. Um, what we knew at 18, they probably know at eight now, and that's just frightening because eventually people get desensitized to stuff and next minute it becomes just a free fall. Word. It, it's okay, so y'all just leave me out there by myself, right? So no, 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 no. I mean, I was looking at Playboy, right? They said not all poly people live in the same house. Yeah, yeah. So, so, oh, so they, they just stop by and visit? You know, like, how does that work? <laughs> they have different, like, I guess, you know, different days of the week they come by? I mean, it, it whatever works. Sometimes you add on because I've seen it before. Where um, on uh, I forgot what network I was watching it. So the guy he had his wife and whatever, and then she went on a trip, and then he, then he went on. Uh, she went on a trip. He went on a trip, and they met with their prospective partners in different locations and stuff like that. And then they, you know, I, I guess it worked. They was all happy. They came back home. I guess a little change up because, like, I remember what's the dude that he's having books. He's having the books back in the day. He's having he's doing the radio on BLS. He said the craziest thing is. Everybody's doing something because the hotels are always packed on the weekend. So why are people acting like nobody's out there creeping? Hey, listen. Oh, I I'll, think I know the guy you're talking about. I forgot I'll, he had the books back in the day. I forgot his name. He was the glasses. Yeah. And so I, forgot I'll, I always say, you know, you talk about these, you know, everybody says, oh, these men out here cheating. They out here cheating. I'm like, well, who the heck are they cheating with? You know what I mean? So yeah, is yeah. it the same five women? You know? Women, no. Yeah, women cheat too. <laughs> yeah.